Hi friends, today now we are going to discuss about the plant cell and animal cell. So before of that first the introduction of the plant cell and animal cell means every organism it is made up of with cells. That is a basic structure and functional unit of any organism. Now here, here we are going to discussing only the plant cell and animal cell. First what is the difference and which cell organelles are present in the plant cell and animal cell? What is the function? How like their structure? We are going to now today. See first the plant cell and animal cell difference. Both are is a cells but one difference is there. Plant cell is a one of the example of autotrophic cell. Animal cell is heterotrophic cell. That means these cells they can't prepare their own food. But the plant cell they prepare their own food. So that is the first difference in between plant cell and animal cell. When we are looked at the internal structure of the cell, these all are called as cell organelles. So first commonly we are observed so many cell organelle cell in plant cell and animal cell. Cell organelles means the structural functional unit of cell. Actual cell is the structural functional unit of organism. But here the cell organelles are the basic unit of plant or animal cell is called as cell organelle. First is the most important cell organelle is nucleus. The nucleus is present in the center of the plant cell and animal cell. Then comparing here, it will be present in the center of animal cell and the side of that plant cell. That is the position of the nucleus in both cells. And then function. is The function is the same in plant cell and animal cell. That control all the functions of cell organelle. Whatever the remaining cell organelles are there, it will be controlled. These are controlled by nucleus. So it will be called as remote of the cell. So from these all cell organelles, nucleus is that is a major uh, act as a remote in plant cell and in animal cell also. Then second one cell membrane. Cell membrane also one of the cell organelle. It will be present in both cells, plant cell and animal cells. Yes, now what is the function of cell membrane? It is protection, due protection to two cells, maybe the plant cell or animal cell, all cell organelles are protected by cell membrane. But the activity, whatever the functions are controlled by nucleus only. But here they are going to give protection to all remaining cell organelles or otherwise as a cell. Third one is mitochondria, one of these are major key role in that cell, plant cell and animal cell. This is also present in both cell. So mitochondria is also known as powerhouse of the cell. So here the power means energy. The energy will be stored in that mitochondria. It will be held for the remaining function of the cell organelle which are present in plant cell and animal cell. So because of it is called as powerhouse of the cell. In From that all uh, cell organelles only the, this cell organelle it will be held for the storage of food or energy. So next one, lysosomes. Lysosomes are also known as suicidal bags of the house. Yes, these are one of the cell organelle. It will be present only in animal cell. What is the function of lysosomes means? They are releasing the enzymes. Commonly the enzymes are helps for the digestion of the any food substances. So this is called after the releasing of enzymes, these lysosomes are going to die. Self they are going to die because of that is called as suicidal bags of the house or cell. Both are same. So lysosomes commonly release the all enzymes which are help for the digestion of food substances. Like carbohydrates, fats, proteins are uh, some are example of food substances. Those are digested by these enzymes. Commonly the enzymes are releasing from lysosomes. The next one, next cell organelle is ribosomes. Ribosomes are also very very important synthesis of fats and proteins. Commonly we are going to take different type of food items. From that fats and proteins both are synthesized by one cell organelle that is ribosomes. Commonly the ribosomes are present in plant cell and animal cell also. So it will be help the storage of fats and proteins and synthesis of fats and proteins from food substances. The next one plastids. The plastids present one of the cell organelle. It will be present only in plant cell. Why? Because the function of plastids is going to give the color. Commonly we are observed so many colors in the plants. Like leaves are green color, fruits are 
like uh, yellow or white orange and flowers are different colors stem roots all are main the causes of the colors is due to plastids so commonly the plastids are present only in plant cell those are absent in animal cell so what is the function of plastids they are going to give colors to remaining parts of the the plant one of the cell organ last one is cytoplasm these all cell organelles are present in cytoplasm only like this is a base of that all cell organelles so cytoplasm is present in both plant cell and animal cell what is the function here that information it will be passed one cell organelle to another cell organelle by cytoplasm it will be help for passing the information so this is a passing the information and cell membrane is protecting and nucleus is controlled so commonly these are all is called as cell organelle are present in plant cell and animal cell so this is about the cell organelles which are present in plant and animal cell and how it is that functions are